for felony child endangerment. Go on. Let him go. You can let him go. He's all right now. <laughs> Mr. Carnes. Mr. Carnes, sit down, please. All right? Listen, I checked the cab company. You got a good record. I told you so. So at least I could tell him that, huh? Hey, look, am I going to get my baby? My sister will be here old Friday. Mr. Carnes, I don't know the answer to those things. I'm, I'm, that's not my job. I'm only the cop. <laughs> Yeah. See it. What's going to be with her? Probably should get out. Probably she'll get a legal aid, just like you did, and she'll contest the proceedings, probably. Yeah. Well, anyway, thanks. You're the only one that stood up for me. You're welcome. He's barricaded the door and making a lot of noise, but it doesn't seem to be threatening. Where's the baby? The other room. Refuse to bring it. That's when he started yelling for it. Okay, go get the baby and hang out in the back. All right. Mr. Carnes, Detective Felker. Right away, just like I told you, they started talking about how I've been in jail. Never mind jail now, Mr. Carnes. Now we're talking about taking hostages. Nobody gives a baby to a guy who takes hostages. It's my baby. He's not the legal guardian. We offered him a 10-day hearing okay, date. Okay, okay. How about this? I'm not taking sides. I'm not. I'm talking to both of you. Let's say they bring the baby now. You can hold him, make sure he's OK. If you open this door and let out the hostages, then we can sit down. We can talk this thing through. If I do that, can I take Timothy home? No. But if you don't let those women go, you're never going to have them. Look. Don't mislead him. His chances are about zilch. Now, this is the kind of comment we don't need. That's now. not our policy. Go ahead, give it to him. You tried to leave with that baby. It's child endangerment. You're off the case, Harvey. Take it easy now, man. Don't do anything straight, all right? <laughs> Hey, Cheese. How you doing, Big Cheese? Huh? Oh, Daddy, love 